the Raptors and the New York Knicks made an absolute monster of a trade. Happy New Year, man. <laughs> Always looking each and every day to try to find something new to get better at. Just find a way to be better. I think it's a part of who I am, so I think I'll fit right in. Really happy, really excited to be here. I'm thankful and blessed. You know, come here and come home. It's a great feeling. One point four to go. It's missed, batted out, and that's going to do it. What a game, what an effort by the Toronto Raptors. And the Raptors, unfortunately, remain winless in the Atlantic Division. Breaking news this afternoon, going to the New York Knicks, OG Ananobi, Precious Achua, Malachi Flynn coming back for the Toronto Raptors. The Canadian RJ Barrett, Emmanuel quickly in a second round pick. Yeah, they all have pretty handled it well, you know, like, oh, gee, it's tough. It's like, that's, that's a real tough one. It's like, all of them, you know, like, they are uh, babies, you know? It is very emotional day, but uh, all I can do is uh, to show my support and to talk to, to, to the guys and to understand their positions as well. And, um, you know, whoever needs to talk or uh, whoever needs like, like to get stuff off their chest, I'm there for them. And uh, through, through all of this, we got to stay together. I mean, it's, it's just OG, Mel, Precious. Uh, I mean, they are brothers, you know. Um, OG been here for seven, eight years, six years, um, a long time. Um, I mean, the NBA is just, uh, it's a business, you know, at the end of the day. Good luck in New York. Thank you. I hope, you know, OG, Mel, and Precious, they're doing, you know, great things and they new world. And um, yeah, we gotta move on. But I like this trade. I think it's a good trade for both teams. And when you look at what the Raptors got, R.J. Barrett, he's a, a Canadian, obviously, a player that's getting better every year in his career, and quickly it's to, could be a factor for the Raptors. What's up, man? I'm good, I'm good, man, you? I'm, pump, I'm so pumped up, man, so pumped up. And I want you to think about growing, winning. I want you to think about, like, a totally like different incredible market. I want you to I want you to think about team leadership. I want you to think about like just taking this thing at a new phase, a new everything, you know, like with Scotty, you know, like it's a it's an unbelievable fit with you and Scotty. This is exactly what we wanted. We're gonna arrange everything. I can't wait to see you, okay? Thanks, man. So pumped. So we want to welcome you guys to get them accustomed to, to our team and to learn what they have and what we have with them and then to grow. Our main objective is, is to grow and to get better and to learn what we have with our roster. Yo, how you doing, man? Got you back to Toronto, man. We're well, really excited, man. This is gonna be, gonna be new, it's gonna be special. I want to get you, you know, like to take it to another level, you know, like we have to do it as a team. So I really, I really look forward to it. We've been trying to do this, you know, like, so we look forward to having you guys, okay? All right, man, travel safe, okay? RJ Barrett and Emmanuel quickly on their way to Toronto. I'm told that they won't be on their way until tomorrow, and then they will be made available to media on Monday. Scary job. My man's is prepared, fam. It's prepared. <laughs> Don't worry. We're good over here, stuff. So. <laughs> Mass are blessed, man. <laughs> Bit of a homecoming for you. Yeah. How's your, you know, your phone has been blown up? What's been going on? <laughs> yeah, uh, a lot of love, a lot of support. Um, you know, I'm, I'm excited to be back. Excited to, you know, to get ready to go. Got my brother quick with me, so, you know, make the transition easier. Uh, but yeah, no, I've, I've been a Raptors fan all my life, so coming back and, and playing for the Raptors is like surreal. You ever watch the show that we should? Yeah, I watch, watch Open Gym all the time, man. All the time, for sure. 
I just looked at the gas. I thought it was 145. Oh. I just told you, bro. I told you that yesterday. It's like 145 dollars for gas. I told him, Jeez. I said, bro, you get paid in USD. It's not the same. That scared me. I was gonna be broke. Really excited. New opportunity, uh, new blessings. Uh, thank God for this opportunity that I get to uh, bring my talent somewhere, uh, somewhere else, and just be able to show what I can do. Uh, and I'm really excited. I don't know where to get no food. <laughs> you gotta grab me some Osmos, bro. But look, you got this guy with you. This is you gotta perfect. grab me some Osmos. <laughs> what kind of food is that? Mediterranean food is fire. <laughs> Osmos. You get you some. You, yeah, you know what I'm saying. You get some some rice, some chicken. Got a little garlic sauce. Ooh, is it like shawarma stuff? <laughs> yeah, is that what it is? Yeah. Oh, I've like never that. tried that one. So make sure you go there. Get some Timbits. Some honey glazed Timbits. What's a Timbit? It's like a, it's like a little donut. donut? It's like a round, yeah, okay. a little, little round donut bites. You don't even understand global warming. When I was young, snow used to be at your hip. <laughs> oh. That's yeah. Jimmy! Ooh. That's cool. You're actually getting two starter caliber players for one essential, one starting caliber player essentially. And I think for both teams, um, they're going to be happy with what they get. Um, it's going to pay dividends for both teams. For the Raptors, I think the dark horse in it, and everybody should be excited, is you, you know what RJ does, but quickly, right? We've played some starter minutes for New York, and you can see what he's done there. That's tough. Hey guys. That's dope, man. There you are. <laughs> Good to see you. Right, come on, Good. Good. What's up, Coach? Don't come, RJ. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Appreciate it. How's, how's the feel coming back home? Man, it's great. Dream? Yeah, right? yeah I'm excited. I'm excited. I wanted to, to be a little bit room today. It's emotional, and it's all the bad. You know, I know that you guys are hard workers and all of that, so if you want to come back and get shots, if you want to be a bit coaches, we can organize a little bit. It's easy. Uh, tomorrow, shoot around is at 10, but I would like you guys to come some. That's good. This is not about me. This is not about me. This is about you guys. This is about us creating a team. And this is, uh, you know, this team was ups and downs, as you know, last couple of years. You know, so this fresh new energy is what we really need. You know, and uh, what we really need is togetherness. Missing out on the gear, my guy. Golly. It's the practice or something. When you look at Emmanuel quickly, he kind of looks like Tyrese Maxey did a couple years ago, where you could see that if he gets in the right situation or gets the right opportunities, he could potentially be very, very good. And maybe this is his opportunity to really explore that. I like what he brings to the floor. And I really think that he's gonna have significant impact probably immediately when he, once he hits the floor. Let's go, last spot over here. Let's go, uh, elbow. Let's go, elbow two, Scotty. Elbow two, Scotty. Uh, you know, we definitely, you know, went over some stuff uh, just now, trying to learn everything on the fly. Um, in terms of expectations and, and role, I have no clue. You know, I just I just got here. So just, you know, trying to see how these games go and, and just see how we can grow, and, you know, as a group. Let's see what you got. Let's see what you got. Positive, very, very good to talk to so far. Like, and then on the court, I think uh, you could already see that even without uh, having played um, a lot of practice or, or anything like that, uh, they're already fitting in very well. Um, they're both like very dynamic players that I think are really going to help us um, get our ball movement going, get get some actions going for each other, uh, and hopefully they'll just keep improving. Yeah.
Timbits. You know what Timbits are? Uh, Arjun told me a little bit about it. Boom. Boom. Timbits good with me. It's been unbelievable. Couldn't ask for anything better. Uh, great city, great culture. Uh, the camaraderie of the team is great. You can tell us uh, people care about each other around here, um, and, and you couldn't ask for anything better than that. He's going to fire the three. Oh, he's feeling it. IQ on the scene. <laughs> Are we about to witness baby's first words? Let's hear them! Oh, John's out by the blender. Rookie move. Oh, so sad. Audio magic eraser? You kidding me? Hello! Hello! Pixel in the clutch! Share that with Grandma! Google Pixel 8. Even better with Bell!